Oh, you got the Leah medal. I can't wait to see how these weapons turn out. We'll need them, that's for sure. You got it. You're gonna be blown away. Trust me. Where's Nal, by the way? He went home. Said he had something to take care of. He left a little souvenir for you. Souvenir? What kind of souvenir? An NPID. An all-access pass to Fun City. Fun City? It's a town built around an amusement park called the Neat Play Town. I'm going to need three days to finish these weapons. Maybe you could hang out there till then. We're about to fight the Ten Wise Men, and you want us to go to an amusement park? Mayor's orders. Besides, this isn't just any normal amusement park. Anyway, get going. I think they're ready for you over there. Um, all right. I'm not really sure what's going on here, but if Nal said so... Oh, don't worry. You'll understand once you get there. Oh, you must be Mr. Kenny. Yes. The mayor's arranged everything for you. Please come this way. Um, so what's going on in here anyway? We're going to use a special program we created to simulate a battle with the Ten Wise Men. Simulate? Yes, a full simulation. As you may be aware, this arena uses virtual reality technology to allow users to battle any type of monster. We used previously collected data to create a virtual version of the Ten Wise Men for you to fight. He must have wanted to prepare us one last time before the real battle. Exactly. Are you ready to go? I'm ready to begin whenever you are. Well done! This simulator's no challenge for you, that's for sure. Oh, very nice. Very nice indeed. Mirage! Hey Claude, how are you doing? I guess you saw for yourself. Are you done making the antimatter weapons, Mirage? Yep, everything's done. First off, this is for you, Claude. The God Slayer. A sword made out of pure antimatter. Next, this is for you, Reyna. The Knuckles of Hope. Also made out of antimatter. And this is Void Matter. It emits resonant frequencies that power up all of your weapons. It couldn't be easier to use. Just carry it around and it'll do its thing for you. 
You'll have an antimatter field covering your weapons at all times. Impressive! Anyway, I'd better be getting back home. What? Already? Well, I've got this dissertation I need to finish up, among other things. Oh. Give it all you've got till the end, alright? I'm on your side. Thank you very much, Mirage. Oh, you don't need to thank me. These were fun to make. Anyway, see ya! Well, we've got the weapons. What next? Don't you think we should stay in Fun City for now? We still haven't heard from Nal yet. Good point. Guess we can train some more in the arena, too. Sounds good. Let me know whenever you're ready. Want to go back to the Centropolis? Hmm. How about we fight the Ten Wise Men in the simulator one more time before we leave? Sounds good to me. Mind if I be your sparring partner? You. Long time no see, my friends. That was quite a battle we had atop Aloria Tower, wasn't it? The funny to see that Raphael was right about you. I see you're still blindly trying to go against us. You're wasting your time. I am Jofiel, and I suppose I should say it's a pleasure to meet you. What are you here for? We heard you were up to something in here. Just thought we'd save you the trouble of coming all the way to us. I'll handle this. We were interrupted last time around. Let's settle things right here, right now! In that case, I'll go hunt down that woman from earlier. Even against a mouse, a lion strikes at its prey with all of its claws. And I will just go kill whatever I feel like. Wait! Hold on there. If you want to chase after them, you'll have to go through me first. Wouldn't want you acting like you're king of the world just because you can beat up on these ventriloquist dummies. <laughs> That's the spirit. Let's see what you got. The enemy, is it? Take it easy, folks. Ha! Poison pellets! Yeah! Poison pellets and yeah! pellets! Southern Cross! Pellets! 
Dragon pellets! Dragon pellets! Thanks! Dragon roar! Poison pellets! Southern Cross! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Poison roar! Dragon poison pellets! could live with this. This... this is ludicrous. You were... brilliant. You have won this battle. We... won? Hurry! We gotta catch the other two! What was that? Ah! Ah! Mama! Help! Help me! <laughs> run, you insects, run. I want to see more pain, more suffering. Quit it now! You, what happened to Zofkiel? We've taken care of him, and now it's your turn. What? I'm going to show you what everyone on Expel felt, what everyone on Need felt, what my father felt! This looks difficult. Be careful! Dragon Roar! Poison! Dragon poison! Roar! Roar! Poison! Dragon Roar! Roar! Dragon Roar! Dragon Roar! Dragon Roar! Thanks. Dragon Roar! Poison! Yeah. Pellet. Poison! Pellet. Explode! Poison pellets! Dragon. Poison pellets! Roar! 
Poison, poison pellets! Very light! Poison pellets! Very light! That makes two. Yeah, but where'd the last one go? Didn't he say he was going to chase after that woman from earlier? That woman from earlier? You don't think he meant Dr. Mirage, do you? Oh no! We've got to get to Armlock fast!
Mr. Tanny, what's going on here? The Ten Wise Men attacked us. We defeated two of them, but another one's heading for Armlock right now. We've got to catch up to him, or else Mirage will be in serious danger. What? I'll contact the Centropolis immediately! We've got to hurry! What the hell? What happened? Pardon me. Is there something going on in Mirage's house? Well, yeah! This guy flew in from out of the sky all of a sudden. Yeah, and then he just went inside Mirage's house without saying anything. You think he's a friend of hers? <gasps> he didn't look very friendly if you ask me. No doubt about it. That's one of the ten wise men. Ah! Mirage! Ah, you came. Took you long enough. Damn you! I'll make you pay for what you did! <laughs> like you're in any position to talk. How many lives have you taken in your little journey so far, hmm? The only lives we took were the monsters you created! Fools! You're completely incapable of seeing things from other people's perspectives. Ah, very well. If you insist on getting in our way, I have no choice but to get rid of you. This looks difficult. This is serious! Dragon Roar! Explode! Poison pellets! Dragon Roar! Poison! Poison! Pe poison pellets! Poison! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Poison pellets! Explode!
I'd appreciate it if you wouldn't leave me for dead quite so quickly. But... I figured the only way I'd survive this little encounter was if I played dead. That's why I didn't put up a fight. Are you alright now? Better than before, at least. Thanks to Reyna. What was the mayor thinking? Doesn't he have any idea how much danger I'm in? Doing this for him? Hang in there. Help from the Centropolis will be arriving soon. I appreciate it, guys. We're definitely starting to make them worry. If they didn't regret spending too much time on preparations before, they sure are now. That's the impression I got, too. We might be in a better position than I thought, but don't get too comfy yet. You're right. We heard that Dr. Mirage was attacked. Yeah, but we took care of it. Oh, really? Well, then I'm glad she's okay now. I also have a message from the mayor. He said to come to Lakwa immediately once you've rescued Dr. Mirage. Lakwa? Everything's ready for you. They're all on standby, ready to leave whenever you are. Well, this is it. The final battle. I wish you the best of luck. We're all counting on you. Mariana! You're alive! Mariana! Draw your sword, Claude. As the last surviving member of the Need Defense Force, I have to test you out. W what are you talking about, Mariana? You're hurt! You need to get to a hospital! It's too late for that. I can't let myself be the sole survivor. It's not fair to everybody else. Wait! This is my last order as captain of the Need Defense Force. Draw your weapon. Show me that you have the power to defeat the Ten Wise Men. I can't fight you, Mariana. Why not? Because I'm a woman? Because I'm injured? Have you forgotten that our hearts lie with your sword? That the future of the entire universe rests on that blade? I don't have what it takes to hurt you, Mariana. You're too weak, Claude. Sometimes you need to be cruel to survive. 
Don't allow yourself to be transfixed on one single thing. You need to feel it with your heart. Feel it, and find the thing that you believe you have to do. Mariana? Mariana! Wait, is that Reyna? What's she doing in here? Upon examining your compatibility level with Claude, I see that you two both lie under fortuitous stars. This bodes very well indeed. R really? That's great. You have nothing to fear. I am sure things will work out for you. If I had any advice for you, it would be to take a more active approach with him, if anything. Thank you very much. Claude, when did you get here? Oh, uh, I... Well, I've been here for quite a while, actually. Oh, you heard all that? Oh no. You really shouldn't trust fortune tellers, you know. Ah. Oh, I didn't mean that in a bad way, Reyna. I mean, I know a lot of girls like you are curious about what your fortunes have in store for you, but fortune telling isn't really about telling your fortune. It's about guidance, something to push you along towards your goal. Well, what's wrong? No, I was just... You're right, you know that? That is pretty much what it is. But that's...
that's not the point here. Why were you listening in on me like that? Oh, yeah. Uh... <laughs> ah, well. I'll see you later. Oh, hey, dude. What do you think this crowd's for? Who knows? Hi, boys and girls! Hmm? I can't hear you! Come on, one more time! Hi, boys and girls! Hey! <gasps> Thanks for coming, folks. I've got a special favor to ask all of you today. A bunch of monsters have broken into our world, and boy, are they up to a lot of mischief. We'll need to use this ceiling orb to round up those bad guys and make the world safe again. But I'm not strong enough to use the ceiling orb all by myself, so I'm going to need all of your help today, boys and girls. Ready, everyone? Let's start casting the symbol together! <laughs> oh no! What's that? No!
love, I am the black scummy. I'm nice, I'm helpful, and okay, maybe I'm a little plump. Nothing's gonna stand between the yellow scummy and his next meal. We are the scummy rangers! Are the good people of the world. You aren't gonna get away with this any longer, baby. I'm hungry. Yeah, get in my minions. No! Fun, Leon? Are you kidding me? That stuff's for kids. <laughs> Still, I'm glad we had the chance to watch. Yeah.
Hey, you've arrived! Sorry we took so long. Where's Nal? He's inside the laboratory, waiting for you. Got it. Thanks. Welcome. Claude, is it safe to say that you are fully prepared for the final battle that lies ahead? Yes, Mayor. We've got the items we need, and we've settled all our affairs. We're as ready as we'll ever be. Good. Let's go to the other room, then. There's something I want to talk to you about. I hear that you've already defeated three of the ten wise men. We sure have. That leaves us with seven to go. Excellent. It's too early to celebrate quite yet, though. Those three were at the lowest level of their hierarchy, the weakest of the wise men. The remaining seven that lie before you are going to be fighting on a completely different level from the first three. Stop trying to scare us like that, Mayor. I'm sorry. I don't mean to undermine your morale before the final battle. But it remains the truth, I'm afraid. Trust me. I promise you will win this. Very well. The second invasion of Fenal is set to begin tomorrow at daybreak. I hope you enjoy this last night in Lockwai, everyone. The last night. Sorry to make you come over here all of a sudden. It's alright. What is it though? Can't sleep? No, it's not that. Do you mind if I sit next to you? Oh, sure. No problem. Listen, Claude. Hmm? I, I thought I'd just give you my thanks while I still had a chance. Your thanks? Thank you, Claude. I never would have made it this far without you beside me. Reyna. You have no idea how much I appreciate what you've done, how you saved Alan and my mother. Whenever I thought I was going to break down, you were there to support me. I... it was nothing like that. It all worked out because you never gave up on yourself, Reyna. I... I just gave you a little push. You did all the rest by yourself. Besides, you've given me a lot of courage to work with, Reyna. Whenever I was anxious or I didn't know what I should do for whatever reason, your presence was the only thing that helped me keep it all together. Claude, I... Reyna, you know... Once we finish this, there's something I'd like to tell you after we get back to Expel. Something you want to tell me? Yeah, something important. You think you'll be ready to listen to it?
Sure, Quad. I will be ready. Hey, Reyna? Hmm? Let's make it back to Expel Alive, okay? Yeah. Promise? I promise. Well, here's to your good fortune. What's this? The symbol of divinity. The symbol of divinity? Yes. You remember the symbol of annihilation I mentioned after the previous battle, right? I think so. The symbol with the power to destroy the entire universe, right? It wouldn't help much to defeat the Ten Wise Men if the universe winds up falling apart. If, by some circumstance, the Wise Men set off the symbol of annihilation, I want you to use this. If you can do that, then the power of the symbol of annihilation will be driven elsewhere. Someplace else? It'll alter the target of the symbol's power, thus keeping the universe from being destroyed. Right, Mayor? Yes, precisely. Mirage? You're already moving around? I'm certainly not going to stay in bed at a time like this. The energy field surrounding Fino will probably disappear once you defeat the Ten Wise Men. If you can pull it off, we'll finally have all of Energy Needs power back online. Then we'll be able to use Temporal Shifting to bring Planet Expel back from the past. Temporal shifting? To put it in layman's terms, we'll basically pull Expel back from the time before it collided with energy need. I suppose this could lead to time paradoxes and so forth, but it'll get Expel back for us at the very least. We'll head for Fenal ourselves once the energy field is gone. I wish you luck. Thank you. Then we'll see you later. Let me know if you want to return to Lakwa. Be careful. Come on, let's go!